Okay, this is a June 2014, question 7, C1, on first principles, on differentiation from first principles. So the question is, y equals minus 3x squared plus 8x minus 7. So first thing you've got to do is every you see a y, add delta y, every you see x, add delta x. So you get y plus delta y equals minus 3 bracket x plus delta x squared plus 8x plus delta x and then minus 7. So everywhere I saw a y added on delta y, everywhere I saw an x added on delta x and obviously this is squared. The next thing you should do then is keep this the same and expand this bracket. So I get minus 3, 4 you times by minus 3, so you get x squared plus 2x delta x plus delta x squared, close the bracket, because you've still got times by this minus 3, plus 8x, plus 8 delta x, minus 7. Okay. Now then, we don't want this y over here, so we're going to move the y over by subtracting what our y was from this side over here. So we end up with delta y. At the same time, I'm going to expand this bracket, so I end up with minus 3x squared, minus 6x delta x, minus 3 delta x squared, plus 8x, plus 8 delta x, minus 7. Like I said, I've taken away the y from here, so I'm going to take it away from this side. So I do take away, go on to the second line now, all of this up here. So take away minus 3x squared, plus 8x minus 7. Okay. So looking at that, we can now see that we can cancel some bits out because remember this bracket here is all minus. So I've got a minus 3x squared and a plus 3x squared, so they're going to cancel. I've got a plus 8x and a minus 8x, so they're going to cancel. And a minus 7 and a plus 7, so they cancel. So I end up with delta y equals minus 6x delta x minus 3 delta squared plus 8 delta x there. Okay, now I want to get rid of the delta x, so I'm going to divide through by delta x. So I get delta y over delta x, which equals minus 6x. This, one of these delta x's goes with so minus 3 delta x. And then I've got a plus 8 on the end there. Okay, only one of those delta x's goes. So, I still want to get rid of this last delta x. So this is where we write this part. So we write dy by dx equals the limit of delta x goes to 0. Brackets dy by dx equals, this means that delta x has now become 0. This is the same as having 3 times 0. So we end up with minus 6x. This becomes 0 because minus 3 times 0 is 0. And then we've just got the plus 8 on the end. And there's our final answer. And that one was worth 5 marks.